Right, so we are back for the second installment of the best of Dokkan Battle for 2020. Of course, yesterday uh, we looked at OSTs, which are, um, I'll embed in the top right hand corner of this video in the information card, but today we'll be looking at active skills to establish a few ground rules. We'll primarily be looking at, I mean not primarily, but we will be looking or basing this list off units that released for the Japanese version of Dokkan Battle for 2020. And um, based on that, we will, we will also be using the Japanese audio for all characters. There's also like an oddity where, for some reason, when you use the English audio, um, especially when it pertains to active skills, you kind of get copyright claimed, and I don't wish I don't wish that. So we'll just be using um, Japanese um, audio. I mean, I'm looking at the list right now. Was there one, two, three, four? So there's four honorable mentions. And out of all the 14 um, units or 14 characters that I have in front of me, only what one, two, three units. So three out of the 14 are just TURs, Dark Confess TURs. Which is, I mean, it should tell you that, I mean, active skills is what I would assume the developers perceive as a premium mechanic, which is why I think only LRs receive, or I say mainly LRs re receive active skills. And um, that's why they a lot more care and effort into um, the active skills that LRs receive, but without further ado, let's hop in. まとうぞ。強く。神の怒りの強さがいかほどのものなの。その身に刻み込め。俺に元気をあげてくれ。はい。はい。究極の進化をご覧なさい。この金色の体が苔脅しではないことを教えて差し上げましょう。行くぜ。早く。いいんだろこれで。三件はベジータ。ベジータと関わってが合体してベジットってとこかな。さらに。いつがスーパーベジット。新生児の身を食べ続けてきた俺に勝てると思ったか俺の勝ちだな情けねえ俺が俺が貴様を倒すここで引くわけにはいかねえんだアカロットの言う通りだ俺は貴様に勝たねばならんのだ行くぞ太陽剣父さんが助けてくれたそして父さんが助けてくれた僕に月を すごいやつだよお前は頭にくるぜ戦いが大好きで優しいサイヤ人なんてよ頑張れかかるとお前がナンバーワンだすごい素晴らしい救世主を送るのは私に任せてくださいうんバッチリありがとうございます<笑>
And with that, we have come to the end of the best active skills for Dokkan Battle in 2020. I mean, I think it was kind of obvious that LL Gogeta Blue and LL Vegito Blue would be the top two spots. Um, and generally speaking, I'm looking at the list now. Are they the only two units on this list who actually perform an attack? I, th I think so. Let's see, um, yes. Yeah, they're the, they're the only, fun funnily enough, they're the only two units uh, on this list to perform an actual attack in their active skill, which, I mean, generally I think active skills are used to, in, to indicate a transformation, but of course the Blue Fusions transform on turn 4. I think I stand by the fact that the um, five year anniversary Blue Fusions um, are probably the, the best produced um, units that Dolcon have actually released. I mean, they're all, from their OSTs to their card arts to their active skills to their animations in general. I mean, they're pretty much flawless. By the way, when I mean that, I'm not talking about in terms of their kit, I'm mainly talking about um, the amount of money that was invested in producing them, which is as it should be, because I mean, the anniversary, of course, is one of the um, more, what's the word I'm looking for, um, decorated times for um, uh, a mobile game, especially one like Dokkan who's been going on for what, six years now, which not many um, Gacha games last, so that's always nice to see. Um, I mean, look, looking down the list, Tech Ultima Gohan is probably, you know, what, he's number three. It's just he's a very wholesome animation, I mean, it's in a whole episode, <laughs> and uh, of course the Goku and the Gohan thumbs up to each other is always nice. Super Saiyan 2 Angel Vegeta's again, uh, similar to Gohan's. Um, very nice that we got that moment in Dokkan. Super Saiyan 2 Gohan was just released now, but his active skill is yeah, his active skill is very good. I really like the touch at the start where Goku's um, carrying Gohan, and then Gohan gets up it. And of course, like every shot in the um, active skill is very clean, very HD looking, which is nice. Yeah, I mean the same with um, the Blue Kai Ken Goku and Evolution Blue Vegeta, Super Vegeta as well. Super Vegeta, like I like the the starting portion, but then when he goes, of course, when he you actually see Super Vegeta on screen, it's very static from that point, um, which I know is it's rep it's representing the manga shot, but I would have liked to have seen maybe a, maybe him powering up or something, so they just him arms out already, and he's, the aura doesn't look that good either, so that's why he's kind of lower on the list, um, and that's why I prefer like the Super Saiyan Bardocks. Um, over the Super Vegitos and uh, to some extent I, why I prefer Turles as well and that's why Super Vegito is so low. Physical Angel Golden Freezer, like his active skill is very good again it's just uh, I like the like the um, the revolving almost like 360 3D shot of him like kind of spinning of course it's, it's the same as the um, anime but uh, again the ending portion doesn't really uh, I don't know it just looks okay to me it doesn't look amazing and of course the honorable mentions, Rose Goku Black, Super Full Power Jiren, and then Blue Kark and Goku. Again, they all, they all look okay. I wouldn't say they really blow me away in terms of um, any sort of extra effects. Jiren's is especially just very mid <laughs> for an active skill, even though I like the unit a lot. It would have been nice maybe if the power-up team was a bit longer, but I mean, that's that's why I like the Blue Fusions. Their animation is so clean. There's so many different angles and shots, and um, you, can, you can only do so much with like a power-up scene, which is why I think like Tech Ultimate Gohan and for example the Super Saiyan 2 Andrew Vegeta, they're so uh, well done. Well that will conclude the active skill list. Tomorrow we'll be looking at super attacks, shouldn't be surprised who's going to top the list there as well. But um, yeah, I'll see you in the next one.